listening to Noah's Weather Radio, KWO39, serving marine interests on Southern Lake Michigan, the Illinois and Indiana shores, and Chicago. The current time is 2.17 p.m. Central Daylight Time. The following is a flash flood watch from the National Weather Service. The Flash Flood Watch continues for portions of Illinois and northwest Indiana, including the following areas. In Illinois, Boone, Cook, DeKalb, DuPage, Grundy, Kane, Kankakee, Kendall, Los South Lake, Illinois, Lee, McHenry, Ogle, Will and Winnebago. In northwest Indiana, Lake and Ann Porter, through late tonight. Thunderstorms producing very heavy rainfall are likely late this afternoon through this evening, given the very moist air mass. These storms will be capable of producing rainfall rates up to 2 inches per hour and lead to localized flash flooding. A flash flood watch means that conditions may develop that lead to flash flooding. Flash flooding is a very dangerous situation. You should monitor later forecasts and be prepared to take action should flash flood warnings be issued. Now here is the hazardous weather outlook for north central Illinois, northeast Illinois and northwest Indiana for this afternoon and tonight. The following weather hazards can be expected. Significant thunderstorm risk with an associated. Significant tornado risk. Significant hail risk up to 2 inches. Extreme thunderstorm wind damage risk 70 miles per hour or greater. Elevated flooding risk. Now here is the hazardous weather discussion. Scattered storms are expected across the area during the early to mid-afternoon with an isolated threat of mainly large hail. A more organized round of thunderstorms will redevelop across northwest to north central Illinois late this afternoon. These storms will gradually increase in coverage as they progress quickly southeast through the evening hours. Very large hail, damaging winds, and even a few significant tornadoes are possible with these storms. The highest threat for widespread severe weather at this time is along and southwest of a line from Rockford to Chicago to Valparaiso. A slight shift north in the warm front position could have higher impacts across the Chicago metro. And now the extended outlook for the period Thursday through Tuesday. Saturday and Sunday limited thunderstorm risk. Limited excessive heat risk. Monday limited thunderstorm risk. Spotter information statement. Spotters will be needed later this afternoon into the evening. General storm motion of the day. Southeast at 50 miles per hour. Now here is the hazardous weather outlook for the Illinois nearshore waters of Lake Michigan and the Indiana nearshore waters of Lake Michigan for this afternoon and tonight. Thunderstorms are likely. Some of these storms this afternoon and evening could be severe and produce winds in excess of 50 knots. And now the extended outlook for the period Thursday through Tuesday. Conditions hazardous to smart craft are possible on Thursday. Thunderstorms are possible at times Saturday night through Monday. Now here is the hazardous weather outlook for the open waters of Lake Michigan for this afternoon and tonight. Thunderstorms are expected to increase in coverage across the lake later this afternoon with the south half favored for higher thunderstorm coverage. Some of the storms may be severe over southern Lake Michigan later this afternoon with winds in excess of 50 knots. And now the extended outlook for the period Thursday through Tuesday. Thunderstorms are possible at times Saturday night through Monday. At 2 p.m. at O'Hara Airport it was cloudy. The temperature was 73 degrees. The dew point was 65 and the relative humidity was 75%. The wind was west at 5 miles an hour. The pressure was 29.89 inches and falling elsewhere around the region. At Benton Harbor, it was mostly sunny with a temperature of 79. At Waukegan, it was partly sunny with a temperature of 76. It was cloudy with a temperature of 77 at Milwaukee Airport, 73 at DuPage Airport, 76 at Midway Airport, and 75 at Gary, Indiana. Once again, at O'Hara Airport it was 73, under cloudy skies. At the Kenosha Harbor entrance, wind through west, at 5 knots. At the Muskegon entrance, wind through west, at 11 knots. In open waters, at the South Lake Michigan buoy, wind through south, at 6 knots. Waves were calm. In open waters, at the North Lake Michigan buoy, wind through east, at 8 knots. Waves were 1 foot. Here is the forecast for the Chicago metropolitan area. Flash flood watch in effect through late tonight. Rest of today, showers late in the morning, then a chance of showers and thunderstorms in the afternoon. Highs in the upper 70s, south winds 5 to 10 miles per hour late in the morning becoming southeast 10 to 15 miles per hour in the afternoon. Chance of precipitation 80%. Tonight, mostly cloudy. 
thunderstorms and showers in the evening, then a chance of showers and thunderstorms after midnight. Some thunderstorms may be severe with heavy rainfall in the evening. Lows in the upper 60s, northeast winds 10 to 15 miles per hour. Chance of precipitation 80%. Thursday, partly sunny. A 20% chance of showers in the morning. Highs in the mid-70s, northeast winds 10 to 15 miles per hour. Thursday night, mostly clear. Lows in the upper 50s in the suburbs, but in the mid-60s downtown. Northeast winds 10 to 15 miles per hour in the evening, decreasing to around 5 miles per hour after midnight. Friday, mostly sunny. Highs in the lower 80s inland, but only in the mid-70s near the lake. Southeast winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. Friday night, mostly clear. Lows in the mid-60s. Saturday, mostly sunny in the morning, then becoming partly cloudy. A 20% chance of showers and thunderstorms. Highs in the upper 80s inland, but only in the lower to mid 80s near the lake. Saturday night, partly cloudy with a 30% chance of showers and thunderstorms. Lows in the lower 70s. Sunday, mostly cloudy with a 50% chance of showers and thunderstorms. Highs in the upper 80s. Sunday night, partly cloudy with a 30% chance of showers and thunderstorms. Lows around 70. Monday, partly cloudy. Highs in the mid 80s. Monday night, partly cloudy in the evening then becoming mostly clear. Lows in the mid-60s. Tuesday, mostly sunny. Highs in the lower 80s inland, but only in the lower 70s near the lake. And now for the marine portion of the forecast. Synopsis, low pressure of 29.6 inches will move east from the middle Missouri Valley this morning to near the southern tip of Lake Michigan around midnight tonight. High pressure of 30.1 inches will then build over the Great Lakes by Thursday night and generally remain in place into the weekend. Sheboygan, Wisconsin to Bentwater, Michigan, north, rest up today. Northeast winds 10 to 15 knots becoming east. Chance of showers and thunderstorms this afternoon. Waves 1 to 3 feet tonight. Northeast winds 10 to 15 knots increasing to 10 to 20 knots. Chance of showers and thunderstorms in the evening, then chance of showers overnight. Waves 1 to 3 feet. Thursday, northeast winds 10 to 20 knots becoming northwest 10 to 15 knots. Waves 1 to 3 feet. Thursday night, northwest winds 5 to 10 knots backing to south. Waves 1 to 2 feet. Friday, south winds 5 to 10 knots becoming southwest. Waves 1 to 2 feet. Friday night, south winds 10 to 15 knots. Waves 1 to 2 feet. Saturday, south winds 10 to 20 knots. Waves 1 to 3 feet. Sunday, south winds 15 to 25 knots becoming southwest 10 to 20 knots. Chance of showers and thunderstorms. Waves 3 to 5 feet occasionally to 7 feet. Sheboygan, Wisconsin to Bentwater, Michigan south. Rest up today. East winds around 10 knots becoming southeast by midday, then increasing to 10 to 15 knots early this afternoon. Chance of showers and thunderstorms this morning, then showers likely with a chance of thunderstorms this afternoon. Waves 1 to 3 feet. Tonight, east winds 10 to 20 knots becoming northeast. Showers likely with a chance of thunderstorms in the evening, then chance of showers and thunderstorms overnight. Waves building to 2 to 4 feet. Thursday, northeast winds 10 to 20 knots becoming north. Waves 2 to 4 feet. Thursday night, northeast winds 10 to 15 knots becoming east. Waves 2 to 4 feet subsiding to 1 to 3 feet. Friday, southeast winds 5 to 10 knots. Waves 1 to 2 feet. Friday night, southeast winds 5 to 10 knots increasing to 10 to 15 knots. Waves 1 to 2 feet. Saturday, south winds 10 to 20 knots becoming southeast. Waves 1 to 3 feet. Sunday, south winds 10 to 20 knots becoming southwest. Chance of showers and thunderstorms. Waves 2 to 4 feet. Here is the nearshore marine forecast for waters within 5 nautical miles of shore on Lake Michigan for the following. Winthrop Harbor to Wilmet Harbor, Illinois. Wilmet Harbor to Northerly Island, Illinois. And Northerly Island to Calumet Harbor, Illinois. Rest of today. South winds around 10 knots becoming east 10 to 15 knots in the afternoon. Showers likely through the day. Thunderstorms likely in the afternoon. Waves around 1 foot building to 1 to 3 feet late in the afternoon. Tonight, east winds 10 to 20 knots becoming northeast 10 to 15 knots after midnight. Thunderstorms and showers in the evening. Then slight chance of showers and thunderstorms after midnight. Waves 2 to 4 feet. Thursday, north winds 10 to 20 knots. Slight chance of showers in the morning. 
Waves 3 to 5 feet, occasionally to 7 feet. Thursday night, north winds 10 to 15 knots becoming northeast around 5 knots after midnight. Mostly clear. Waves 2 to 4 feet subsiding to 1 to 3 feet after midnight. Here is the nearshore marine forecast for waters within 5 nautical miles of shore on Lake Michigan for the following Calumet Harbor, Illinois to Gary, Indiana, Gary to Burns Harbor in, and Burns Harbor to Michigan City, Indiana. Rest of today, south winds around 10 knots becoming southeast 10 to 15 knots in the afternoon. Showers likely through the day. Thunderstorms likely in the afternoon. Waves 1 to 2 feet. Tonight, east winds 10 to 15 knots becoming northeast after midnight. Thunderstorms and showers in the evening, then chance of showers and thunderstorms after midnight. Waves 1 to 3 feet. Thursday, north winds 10 to 20 knots. Slight chance of showers in the morning. Waves building 2, 3 to 5 feet occasionally to 7 feet. Thursday night, northeast winds 10 to 15 knots becoming east around 5 knots after midnight. Partly cloudy. Waves 2 to 4 feet subsiding to 1 to 3 feet after midnight. Lake Michigan water temperatures, Chicago shore. 71, Chicago Crib, 68, Wilmette Bowie, 66, Michigan City, 66, Michigan City Bowie, 69, South Mid Lake Bowie, 61. This is Noah's Weather Radio Station KWO39. Serving marine interests on Southern Lake Michigan and the Illinois and Indiana shores, 24 hours a day on a frequency of 162.55 MHz from our transmitter high atop Will Left Tower. This station will also broadcast severe weather events for Southern Lake Michigan, Lake and Cook Counties in Illinois, and Lake and Porter Counties in Indiana. This broadcast originates from NOAA's National Weather Service Forecast Office in Romeoville, Illinois. For the complete Chicago metro area weather broadcast, tune to KZZ81, Lockport, on frequency 162.425, or KXI-41, or Crystal Lake, on frequency 162.500. Visit us on the web at weather.gov slash Chicago. You are listening to NOAA's Weather Radio, KWO-39, serving marine interests on Southern Lake Michigan, the Illinois and Indiana shores, and Chicago. The current time is 2.29 p.m. Central Daylight Time.